this is Natsu of Team Fairy Terror. First, a deck profile. This is my hope deck, which basically um, is all around hope and the ZW cards and this card. But we're gonna get into him a little later. So here's the deck. Uh, start off with BLS because BLS BLS is just boss. He's just boss. BLS is awesome. Then we run one Dark Zexa weapon Chimera Cloud. So this card, um, you can equip it to a Chaos 39, um, so like Hope Ray Victory, Hope Ray V, and just regular Hope Ray. So basically, alright, so it can't be destroyed in battle, period. And then when it attacks the opponent's monster, and that card wasn't destroyed in battle, you can uh, make it its attack point zero, and it can attack it again. But, and, but the attack points have to drop to zero for the, it to make the second attack. This is really, really good against Zen mains, because you pretty much get rid of all of Zen mains materials, so if you have, like, something else and get over the Zen mains, then you win. Or not you win, but, you know, you get rid of Zen mains. I actually won a game because someone left Zen mains in attack mode, and I was like, oh, it's cool, I'll make Copra victory, and then I'll give it Chimera Clad, and then I'll attack your Zen mains twice. It doesn't even matter. Uh, you take 28, and you take 43, you lose. Then, um, oh, um, then, uh, Double Veiler, because Veiler's just too good. Triple Magdalar, because it's a easy spell summon level 4. Then, um, Triple Thunderbird, because it's another uh, easy level 4 that can get that level 4 on the field. Then, Triple Goblin Bird, because once again, that level 4, we want Hope on the field as quickly as possible. One Gores, because Gores. Um, honest, because we can make Hope eat, have even more attack points, because Hope's a light monster. Triple Hydro get on, because once again, we want to get those level 4s as fast as possible. Maxi, because Maxi's kind of staple. Thunder King, I like Thunder King. Thunder King's spell books, I like Thunder King, because you your opponent needs to have to have more life points to get it out. Special limit, and basically, it gives a Hope monster 2,000 extra attack, and you can negate a trap per turn, which is pretty darn good. Then double tornado bringer, so this makes hope gaining up twelve hundred attack, and um, Z and uh, Zex weapons can't be destroyed by card effects, so they can't MST a sex weapon, or something like that, or they can't like scrap dragon. Well, they probably just scrap dragon your hope anyway, but um, well, it depends. But you know, oh wait, this is lightning blade. What am I saying? Um, double slamper mail. It gives the card an extra thousand attack. It's level four, so you can use it to make hope, which I've done before. And also, when the Hope monster leaves the field, if they somehow make it leave the field, which is very, very hard to, but it's it's been done, um, you can bring one back. And I've won games because of that that effect. Like, oh, it's cool. You, you got over it. It's cool. I'll just make another one. Less materials, but I can still make another one. And then double Tornado Bringer. This card's amazing. Tornado Bringer makes, um, makes, it, makes Hope untargetable. You can't target it, so it's too good. So that's all the monsters, 30 monsters. Deck pretty consistently, like, I'd say every two games, Ophion comes out every other game. So, Infestation really comes in handy, because I can protect Ophion, <laughs> and Ophion's really, it's, Ophion's pretty good though. And then, my control, because I, you can, um, you can my control their hope, <laughs> and then use their hope with your, to use their hope, and it's hilarious, I've done that too, too before. Double Baryon's Force, because... Barrier Force um, help make a uh, Hope Ray V and Hope Ray Victory, and then Triple Numeron Force because Numeron Force also wins games because this card it negates the effect of everything else face up on the field negate the effect. It's too good. Uh, double Decree because I don't like I don't like the traps, and then lastly one Warning because Warning. Um, then for the extra deck, um, Dagusa Emerald for the Potter for the so Emerald. Um, Ophion. I might add in a second Ophion, though. Just because Ophion, I can make it pretty consistently, because I have the six evil forms. Uh, Lagia, because I can make it, because <laughs> Hydra get on. <laughs> and I've also had games where I had Lagia and, uh, Ophion out, and they just dipped. <laughs> Gaga got Cowboy, because it's too good. Uh, level chain, pretty much to get, if I need to get, um, to get whatever I need to get on top of my deck. Uh, Masquerade, because I can make it, and because you can also make the Chaos Masquerade, and it's not that bad either. Um, Double Hope, because Hope is the kind of the key card. 
uh, one masquerade. I'm probably gonna take this out, just because I never make it ever, but, um, double, uh, Hope Ray. This, alright, so what you do with Hope Ray is, um, you make Hope, and then you make this card, then you do run our, and rank up magic. Simply because, um, that gives it an extra material, so the materials can come handy, especially for, um, Hope Ray Victory. Um, double, ho um, double Hope Ray V. His effect, um, the, as long as he has Hope as a material, you detach a, you detach a material, and then you pop a card, and then if they pretty much take damage equal to the monster's attack points. No, you pop a card, you pop a monster, and then they take damage. So it's pretty good. And then, Hope Ray Victory. When he attacks... Your opponent can activate spells and traps in response, like, so no magic cylinder, no mirror force, n none of that, none, none of that, none of that. And then, on top of that, when he when he attacks, if he has hope on as a material, you can attach a material to basically on it. It's so good. It's so good. This, this card, and you give it, like, you give it this, and this, and, like, that's already, this two, that's 20, that's 35, that makes him a 60. Makes him like 73 with Honest Bolton. <laughs> GG. So that's the deck. It's pretty good. I definitely, I love it. The deck kind of loses to, um, Hope Ray Victory can kind of lose to, um, whatchamacallit. He can lose to Compulsory though. That's the only issue, but Compulsory at one, so it's not that big a deal really. Um, if anyone has any suggestions or anything about, or anything like that, leave it comment down below and be sure to check out the rest of our vids and subscribe. This has been Not So with Team Fairy Tales signing out.